Let's go and find this underground fight club. The Death Arena, the Thunderdome. It's this way, I'm sure. Yeah, it is. All the way south and then left. We should... Who's this guy? Grandpa. This is where the president lives. You must never interrupt his luxurious lifestyle. I bet he lives in a pit of his own feces. Oh no, maybe we can speak to the guards. I want to speak to this guy that's pumping up the jam in here. Let's see if he speaks. He's Oh, he's fighting in the tournament. I bet you this guy's fighting in the tournament as well. Once I win at the Mega Arena of Doom, I'll ask for a trip to the surface. So they do know that they're underwater. Hey you, what's a kid doing here? Calm down, Scott has participated in the arena. That brat is a fighter? Come on now. Well, suit yourself, the more the merrier. Hey Scott, you will fight a series of strong opponents in there, and you cannot use items. Oh good, I like this. The president is merciless when it comes to his arena. It's Cadium. Is Cadium so bad because of this guy? Yes, pretty much. He may be wacky, but we can't deny that he's powerful. Since Cadium is so hard to access, the guild gave up on retaking the city. Only higher ups like Amelia still come down here for stuff. Right then, um, let's fuck some bitches up. So this is the arena. Are they trying to capture that Nexomon? Alright, I think I get it. Oh, that's it. Are we fighting now? Oh no, there can be only one. The Mega Arena of Doom. I like it. It's like Mad Max. Ladies and gentlemen of Acadium, he has arrived. The most handsome, the most intelligent, the king, the master, the lord of our city. Who's this guy I think he'd come as? President Zeta. What is that guy doing here? I don't even know who he is. He looks like one of them fake Power Rangers. Cadium, my Cadium, the greatest city in the world. It's time to celebrate my greatness with a tournament. Mortal Kombat. Only the strongest will prevail. Well, I am the strongest. Only the second strongest will prevail. You know the rules, my dear pathetic slaves. Three consecutive fights, no items, items are for cheaters. I agree. Fight with all of your might and you'll get anything that your heart desires. Restrictions apply. I want to be sucked off by the master of Acadium. Let the games begin. Hey Scott, that guy Zeta is one of Dina's siblings. It seems like nobody realizes that he's actually just a ghost. Oh then, maybe he'd help us without having to fight in the arena. Nah, it's never that easy with this guy. Three battles, no items. If we win, we can ask for the key to Amelia's lab. I will participate too. Only one of us has to win, right? I'm not letting Scott take the spotlight. I'll show you how it's done. When you're ready to fight, speak with the agent over there. I'll be watching you, buddy. I feel like it's going to be quite difficult. Level 32, 33. Right, so the enemies we're fighting are probably going to be about 38. I would imagine. I think I might switch all got out for someone that's higher level. Only thing is, is there a Pokemon switching bench here? No. I was thinking about bringing that. That water guy. Wait, wait there. There's got to be a Pokemon switching bench. No? Really gonna make me walk all this way? You know what it is, why don't we just... I'm just gonna do it. But then again, no, oh, I think... I would like another water Pokemon. 
And I, I do like that. That one we caught. The, the Angel of the Sea, whatever it is. The one that we used to use. It's only rare, but I need to see its skill set. Because Orgoth's going to get wrecked if all of these are water Pokemon because he's rock. Right, let's have a look. Default. Where is she? Oh, we've got a high... We've got a high knock. Level 35. Grevel, it's Grevel's evolution. Where is it? There it is, Grevin. Level 36. Let's swap that for Org Orgot. And let's have a look at the skills. Water Blast. That's good. Toxic Splash. Recover. It's got Recover. Brilliant. Blue Mirror. For five turns, damage received from normal. So that's shit. What skills has that bird got? Even though it's only level 35. He's got recover as well. Bubble attack. Crap. Frostbite. Crap. Power up. It's... It's a bit shit. I thought I would have had a more powerful attack by now. Although attack and defense by 50% is good. I think I prefer the other one. But wait there. 130, 154. Hynok does have better stats. This has better skills. Yeah, we've got to go with this. Right, get rid of Hynok. Where's my bro? Sort by element. He's gone? Oh, there he is. Raksuma. But that's it, that, that's the team we're taking in. Let's go. Oh shit, I have to restock Raxuna because I bloody traded him out. Take the damage, take the stamina, take the experience. Revan, you take all this shit. Let's go. Heal up because I think somebody hasn't got full health. Right, we're ready. I'm ready to fight in the arena. I think we'll manage it, you know. We are quite powerful. We've got I've got two water Pokemon, which is good because that means we'll do we'll get neutral. We'll both deal and take neutral damage from anything that I imagine everyone's going to fight with water stuff. And we've also got two grass Pokemon. One's not exactly a high level, but still it's it's the opposite affinity. The, the powerful opposite affinity. I'm ready to fight. Let's do this. Three battles, no items. I'll heal your next one before beginning. Oh, that's good. That's good. Well, ready to brawl then. This is easier than I thought. If they if they're gonna heal up between battles, I'm ready. Your first opponent is Ross. Really? You think that you're all cool and mighty just because you're a gold team and now, her Scott? I'm here for a rematch. I haven't forgotten about the Drake Isles fight. You were a punk ass bitch then, and you're a punk ass bitch now. Level 37 versus a level 32. I'll take those odds. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna use natural heal. I'm just gonna go. Vine Whip. It's okay.
pretty big damage that. Spank that ass! Oh shit! Um, okay, right, let's switch out. I don't want them to die, I might as well get the experience. A Nemancy! I know the perfect opponent! I'll blow this guy's tits off, watch this. Cybomb will do big damage. Get wrecked. Rock? Rock type Pokemon? Combination! Oh, have some of that right in your face, you little bastard. What even is that thing? It looks pathetic. You're getting wrecked, bro. Now, before we kill this... Oh, no, no, no. Psychic. That was good damage, even though it's not really massively effective. I kind of, before we end this battle, I want to reuse, re regenerate, renovate on my character so I've got full health, so I don't have to use any... Well, actually, we get healed at the end of the battle anyway, so I'm not, I'm talking talk shit. And you're dead. See ya. You're dead as well, bro. Oh, you're playing them shits, are you? Okay, well, I can do the same. Bling bling. Oh, fuck, this guy's going out with all out attack. Too bad he's dead. That was awesome. Absolutely wrecked them. Who's next? Yeah, Ross, you're a little bitch. No! I feel like he forgot why we're here in the first place. Are we going to fight the girl with the pink hair next? Your second opponent is... Some random guy, looks like Baraka. Ah, surface dweller, aren't you? You think that you're better than us with your fancy oxygen. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Mate, you seem to be breathing oxygen down here as well, you two. Water? Ah, oh, shit, my guy's nearly dead. Right, let's switch to Raksuma. Oh, hey, that's cool. I've never seen one of them before. Shark Nexamon. I like the way it looks. Big damage, yeah? But tell you what, why don't we just get a recover on the go? Ooh, that's, he's doing big damage, right? But now we're going to do big damage. Oh, taste the rainbow, bro. I'm going to make sure I kill him. I'm going to use this. Forest energy? I think this will kill it. Yep, did. Lightning? Oh, we're strong against that. Get wrecked. Was easy. Did this guy only bring two monsters? Really? Who's next? Your third opponent is a bin. We're fighting a bin. A bin man. <laughs> my my. A surface dweller dares to challenge me, the champion of Cadium. Oh, feeble mortal, pursuing a distant dream of grandeur, aren't you? Cruel is the mistress of fate, pitting you against me. That dude's wearing a trash can. He's wearing a bin, mate. Water. Well, well, well. I'm glad that used that, because I'm doing the same. I thought, hold on. I thought he said we get healed between battles. It was quite the lie. Did that guy not blatantly lie to us? He was like, oh, I'll heal you between battles. Wrong. Only thing is, we're going to run out of stamina now, and we can't use items. Not bothered. Wreck its tits. Right, 
rock is going to get destroyed as well. Oh, big damage. Right, now what I want to do is I want to save up. Save up stamina so I can hit him with a thorn pit again. Oh. I'm not going to switch out. That was fucking huge damage. If we don't do this, we might die. Please let this go off first, otherwise we're dead. Yes, we got it. Oh, the poison killed us. What a jib. I forgot about that. I forgot ticks of poison can kill you through that. So who's this a ghost? Hog will destroy it. Although we've got no stamina. Right, let's do this. Then we'll concentrate on just getting our stamina back slowly but surely. I think combo combo is good against rock. We'll save up for it. Ghost? Psychic's good against Ghost. We'll get two of these attacks off. Oh shit, no, it's the other way around. Ghost good against Psychic. Oh shit. Oh shit. Right, Lumi, you need to go and do the damage. Go on, just get in, get stuck in. Now, please kill it. Oh, I didn't die, but it switched out, that was good. Rock, Blizzard, you're up. Punch its head in. Oh, Ice would have been good against this. So was that, really. Nice. You're dead. Easy. Poor Grevin died, like. Oh, Faria leveled up. Everyone did. I'm the champion, my friends. So you have finally come, Scott. Oh, you noticed, did you? <laughs> this guy was staring in my pants. Everything is going to you. Everything is going according to your plan, Dina. Really? Oh, Dina's is she a traitor? I like Dina. Well, well, well. If it ain't Scott, rejoice, kid, for you're meeting the coolest member of the gang. Another one of those ghosts, sir. What's your element? In ancient times, I was known as the Invincible Luxa, Champion of Thunder, Serpent of the Storm, the sixth child of King Omnicron. Now, if I'm the president of this dumpster, how did you end up here in the first place? This used to be such a cool place, you know. But for some mysterious reason, the people became dumb after I took over. Anyway, I want to know why you're here, Scott. I've been waiting for you to hand over the remainder of my power. Why did you fight in my arena though? You could have just asked me for it. Fair enough. Now you can smite things with a billion watts. Cool, eh? This will come in handy when you face Vados. So it's true, Vados is hiding somewhere in the city. If you hadn't come, my plan was to sink Cadium. Bang. Are you guys that afraid of Vados? Take it as a yes. Some bling mansion this even with four elements the tyrant egg is not hatching the true king of monsters definitely lies inside this egg guys we can't beat Vados with an egg <laughs> we only need to get Amelia before she releases Vados and that coward is hiding somewhere in the city well said lass her lab is to the northwest take this yeah I thought it was that's when we saw that big door Sir Zeta, if Scott and I fail on this mission, I will sink Cadium. I will obliterate this cursed city boom. No matter what happens, Vados must never be allowed to exist. Zap. Aren't we judging Vados too soon? You've no idea what's going to happen if he gets to the surface. 
Cadium is but a small sacrifice in the face of extinction. You've received Zeta's power of thunder. You can now power up various devices across the world. Okay. Don't know if I've ever seen them though. But is there anything to steal? have the key we know the location. After this the guild will surely brand us as traitors we will be persecuted. How did it end up like this? I haven't got the faintest idea what you guys are up to but I will stick with you. If I get enough screen time I might get a cameo in the next game. Amelia's place is to the north of my garden got it? Got it. But what was in here again? Did I even look in here before? Nothing. Come on then. Right, let's get healed up. Grebin. We didn't even get a chance to use her. I'll keep her in the party for now. Just simply because she's level 36. And I don't want... I think having a level 30 is too underpowered. And that's what our dude that we switched out for. What we call or Orsam or something. Too low level. We could grind them up, but I'm... I'll be bothered. I don't think Rock-type Pokemon are that special. I think they're a bit shit. Okay, Faria's level 33. Yeah, I think we're doing good. Lumery's probably not the best to have on the team. But I'm happy with this. Let's go. Or we'll get stuck on the plant pot. Either or. Also, it's already open. The gates are now open. Amelia and Vados must be inside. The mad woman who betrayed our trust. Let's end this once and for all. Right, let's stick a cheeky save on the go. Let's do it. I think I'm going to switch. Raxuma, you go as first place. What are we going to fight? We Who is it? Amelia? I don't know what Pokemon she uses, but our dude's good against everything, so we'll take him in. As long as it's not fire. Battles domain. Got a laser beams. What's up with this place? I can't see anything. Only the security mechanisms are still active. Well, she's already expecting us. If we corner her, she might desperately release Varos. Be ready for the worst. Ah, okay, we've got teleportations. Are they safe? No. Oh, look! We've got the Thrama. I need that in my life, by the way. I don't know how rare it is. We never looked. Please don't kill it. Oh, perfect! Right, capture it, baby. Oh yeah! Right, a thrummer. 
This next one is full of surprises, every part of its body is a potential weapon. Quite. I think it's quite powerful. Um, centre storage for now. I want to check how rare it is. It's common. I didn't expect that. But the question is where the fuck am I going? See, that's wrong. You can't go anywhere from there. I feel like Mario. I mean, what, what, a yes? What the fuck? How do I get out after switching? Ah, oh, I didn't know we could walk through there. Definitely got to be down. Look at the size of this blimper. Big blimper. Go on, Lumery. Get your rocks off on this. It's going to destroy us, probably. It's not great. Incineration! Well, we might as well put him back in front since this is just a regular. I thought it was going to be a boss battle, but it's not. Which one should I do? I want to do this one. Rock. Okay. Big damage. Even bigger damage. Oh, it didn't cut shit. I should use the other one. Never mind. I've got no fucking idea where I am, if I'm honest. Don't care, mate. Oh, I feel I'm dead. Dickhead, blood. Why would I do that? Yeah. I need to get to that hole. Oh, look at that. Rep the mortar. We're going to get wrecked if we don't escape. Oh, but we escape, so that's okay.
at Hilo. Because this is going to be a fucking nightmare, this puzzle, honestly. I can just see this puzzle is going to put a massive pain in me left bollock. I know what I have to do. I have to get back to that section. Hopefully everything stays the same, I think it did. Now one this is where I need to be. Not where I need to be. What the Falk? <laughs> this is definitely the wrong way. back the way we came. I think that's what's going to have to happen. That's most definitely not what we're supposed to do. So okay, what happens if we go in here? We end up in that... We end up here. Don't want to be there. a completely different room. Oh, look at that. I bet you that's rare. Okay. I don't care, son. I don't like to let report when I think I wank. Aha! Looks like a great success! Greed wallet, baby. This isn't where I need to be. Where am I even supposed to be going? I think I know. Along that corridor at the back. Aha! Yes! Excellent! And we've got a fast travel. Amazing. Look over there. That's a warp stone. Now we can heal our next one and get supplies. Perfect. I don't think I need to actually. Everyone's got full health. Nice. Right, let's fight this beast, whatever it is, whoever it is. Amelia, I've come for you. Now, I think it will be sensible to start with something powerful. We're going to start with Raxuma.
Just to warn, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> I'm gonna sneeze. What is my legacy, Scott? You know, decades ago we had a stronghold called Royal City, which was annihilated by the tyrants. Then we lost Solus, the city of sand and stone. Then volcanic city of Ordignisha was completely erased as well. Then Cadium fell to that idiot. Even the frozen tundra is in shambles as we speak. Under my rule, humans have lost everything. It's my fault that you were born into this miserable world, but no more. Vados. Vados is my redemption. He is the turning point in our history. He will take back everything that the Nexamon stole from us, the humans. I don't care, Amelia. As noble as you make it sound, this monster is anything but redeeming. One way or another, your madness ends here. Oh, look at Zane, Dr. Octopus. Ho, 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 not so fast, dear. Logan, renegade of thunder. How can you support a horror like this? So close-minded, not even a chance for the poor Vados. Logan, I allowed you to keep your tyrant just to protect Vados. Make yourself useful and summon it now. Oh, so we're going to fight a lightning tyrant, are we? I'm going to destroy it. We picked a good choice having Raksumi first. As you wish, boss lady. But then again, he might have other Pokemon with him. Balzan, come to me. I'm dying to see what it looks like. Like right now, Balzan. Oh, he's a big boy. That's the electric type tyrant, Balzan. It, it looks strong. Come on, Scott. We must defeat him and make our way towards Vados. What's wrong, Lydia? Where's your tyrant, Eurus? Doesn't Eurus know how to swim? <laughs> Let's go, Balzan. Your job is to protect Vados at all costs. Level unknown, he's got 556 health, okay, so the first thing we're going to do is recover. He doesn't even hit very hard, he's a big fairy. I don't think we even need to switch out, we're going to destroy him. Thorn pit, baby. Oh, you're weak. This is a tyrant, is it? It's pathetic. Right, what we need to do is we need to be careful here. Next attack we need to use Absolute Barrier. Just in case. Right, we need to use Barrier again. I don't think we're going to have enough stamina to kill this. Oh, I'm paralysed, but that's okay. I'm just going to heal him. Super Potion 80 HP, that's not great, is it? It's good enough. Come on, stop being paralysed, bro. Oh, have some of that. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm paralysed, but I might as well recover. I did recover. 50. Let's try Absolute Barrier. Paralysed didn't work. We might die here. He didn't die. Still paralyzed. I'm just gonna switch out. One furry, I see if you can get the kill. Oof. Might struggle here. Oh shaman baby. Oh, we're not gonna get the kill. Never mind. We might one more, go on son, one more. Survive it, survive it, be a survivor. Yes! Go on, son. And we leveled up.
Mate, you got wrecked. You are a fantastic tamer, Scott. You know, I wasn't there to congratulate you on your promotion to Gold Tamer. But it doesn't matter now, does it? Once Varos reaches the surface, we won't need tamers like you and me anymore. We will finally be able to rest. You and Varos have nowhere to run to, Amelia. It ends now. Such a lack of imagination, Lydia. And that is your greatest weakness. Listen to me, traitors of the guild. Traitors of mankind. The work of my life lies before you. He is not a Nexamon, nay, nor is he a tyrant. He is our future. Varos will slay the tyrants and purge the Nexamon. No more walls for our people. No more fear for our children. I'm so tired of losing Scott. I'm so tired of hiding Scott. I'm tired of fighting. This is my last stand. This will be my legacy. What's she doing? Is she going to turn herself into an Nexamon? Oh no, she's going to do a Dr. Robotnik and blast him into space. What's going on? His capsule is taken off. She's planning to launch Vados. He'll reach the surface. Don't do this, Amelia. We'll all regret this. Too late. We failed. This is it, Amelia has won. Well, she hasn't. I can beat Varos now. That thing is outside, it's on the surface now. If Varos turns out to be as insane as the dragons, just how much destruction can he bring? We are renegades now, aren't we? Traitors. Who's this Sonic? Sonic the Hedgehog getting the cameo. Oh, it's him. Hello, friends. Whoa, look at that. Vados is gone. You actually defeated him. Goodness, humans aren't so bad after all. I misjudge you. He escaped. <laughs> oh no. Oh jeez, oh jeez. I should have sunk this place. I knew it. It's all over. It's all over. First, Vados will purge the tyrants. But that's a good thing. Let him destroy the tyrants for all I care. Idiots, think about it. Vados will decimate the whole planet just to make sure that the tyrants cease to spawn forever. Boom is that pow. He will burn everything just to eradicate the tyrants. Do you care now? There's only one last thing we can try. I need you to return to the surface, follow me at once. He seems really shaken up, I guess Vados is the real deal. You heard the weirdo, let's follow him, we've got nothing to lose now. No loot? Let's do it. This sub will take you to the surface. Scott, you must return to the orphanage and tell your mentor what happened, alright? He'll know what to do. How do you even know a mentor? Just go, come on. And now this guy knows a lot for being trapped underwater. Oh shit, we got a battle on our hands. I have a visual on the Renegades. I repeat, the Renegades have surfaced. Oh shit. Is it Amelia? It is as Amelia predicted. The traitors are infiltrating the capital city. Well, well, well. Renegade Lydia. So she has corrupted those poor children. Ross, Nora, Coco and Scott. You are accused of committing high treason against the guild and the capital. It pains me, but you are hereby sentenced to a lifetime in Lateria. Not so bad. Lateria? That's where they send all the criminals. This was the short shortcut Zeta had for us. That idiot just sent us to Amelia's own city. It's no use. Amelia, she always, she's always a step ahead of us. Yeah, so this is the proper way to get to Lateria. Because we went there before, but there was nothing really we could do. 
arrows? They took away my badge. Oh well. Lateria, this is a mercenary town full of tamers who refuse to live under the law of a guild. I like the sound of this place. What are we supposed to do? I'll just get out, watch this. Don't lose faith, Scott. We have allies outside, don't we? People like Leo and Elisa know about Amelia's secrets. There's still hope. Robot, what do we do? Do you not have some sort of lockpick? I still can't figure that out. Why did Dina want you to retrieve me? What's my role here? I just don't get it. Oh, there's Big Boss Man. Identify yourself. Don't you see? I'm the almighty Luxor himself. I'm also the president of Cadium. Okay, look, I'm obviously very important. I'm here to request the immediate release of Scott and his servants. No, get lost. Very well. I try to do this peacefully as possible. But you'll now face the wrath of Luxor. I got sparked out. Um, I guess being dead made me weaker. Sorry guys, you're on your own. What a bitch. You've got to be kidding me. Ah, there he is. Another intruder, who the heck are you? That is none of your business, move it. What did you say? Listen here, old timer. K.O. Scott, I heard that you failed to destroy Varos. That is a little troubling. Hey, how did you get in here the in the first place? To make matters worse, the gods took away your tyrant egg. Oh shit. It is impossible to de defeat Varos without your own tyrant. It's time for some desperate measures. Scott, there's an observatory in this town. You must meet me there. Why don't you come with us? We need to find a way out first. Worry not about me, Nora. I have my methods. Observatory. His methods. Your mentor is rather peculiar. But first let's focus on escaping before the gods realise what's going on. Don't gotta tell me twice. Whoa, what's that? Something's going on outside. You think it's Vados? Oh, look! Oh, look, that's a mining girl! Oh, shit. We're not at full health. Should we be? Let's fight. Get back into your cell. Come and make me fools. This won't end well. Aye, she's hardcore, isn't she? Like a wrecking ball. By Ulzar. I've never seen so much violence in all my life. So, why are you here? Because of you. Really now? What do we do? You idiots are branded as renegades. The guild is jailing anyone who is even remotely close to you. You're close to us? At least I don't have to see the weird monster anymore. What weird monster? Oh, you don't know. The guild just announced some kind of super Nexamon called Varos. So powerful that he can slay all tyrants, they say. I just can't stand the sight of him flying around the world searching for tyrants. It's just so creepy. This is bad. We need to move now. Oh, you're escaping. Let me come with you. Can't you just dig a hole to escape? Of course not. They took my tools away. Mate, you're standing there with a big pickaxe. I I can see that you have your pickaxe right there. Nah, I don't have it anymore. The, de the developers just don't have the money to draw me without the pickaxe. That is hilarious. Guys, we need to find Scott's tyrant egg. It's invaluable if we want to ever have a chance to defeat Varos. One of the buildings here must be holding our possessions. Let's go upstairs and take a look around, shall we? We shall.
Oh, look, we're gonna have to avoid their paths. Where is the observatory? I imagine it's north. All right, let's see. Our stuff must be in one of these buildings. We've got to avoid the gods, so be careful. Start here, we'll just go clockwise. This is a fight. Hey you, you're not supposed to be here, go back to yourself. Ah, uh, we don't even get to fight them. Right, this is shit. It's not so bad really. I suppose fighting would take longer. At least we know what happens if we get seen. So just, do, they've probably got a corner vision. About 30% or 60% vision cone. I imagine 60%, so just stay out of their, their eyes. Wow, well, stood on the other side of this fucking postman, you bell in. Oh my god, I can see this being infuriating. I've got a better idea. What I'm gonna do is I wanna go outside. I wanna save it, and every time I get caught, I'm just gonna load the save game up. Weed wallet. Oh, I was hoping that was my stuff. I'm just gonna stay as far away from them as possible. That's weird, because look, I'm. Uh... It doesn't matter, I, they, because the, I need to turn this off. The auto saves fucking my ability to save it, save it. Ah, oh, this, this, it's designs like this which is just shit in games, isn't it? Should automatically just skip this running bit and just put you outside. What the fuck? Bro, I was stood next to him. Oh my god, it's so shit. This, this game is so shit. Oh, I'm back here, yeah, great. Fantastic. Right, how much? I just need to. Get outside and save it now, at least the autosave won't trigger if I save it now. Look at this, the autosave's f- what the f- I turned it off? Disable. Top slot. I'll put us back here. So how do I get over there then? Bang. That's a lot faster than running about outside like a fucking bell end. How do I get how do I get past him? 
Oh my days, this is just the worst. I hate, I hate this game. You've got no in indication of what the cannon can't see, it's not consistent. Oh, why do this? Why, why, why spoil a good game with this wonk? Also. Right, I've got an idea of how this is going to work. I don't think that guy standing at the top of the screen can see me looking down. Right, watch this. Oh, he saw me. I should have been a square foot further forward. Okay. Right, watch this. I've just got to get to that. Go down along to here. As long as he doesn't walk further forward. Oh, he... How did... He doesn't walk further forward. He doesn't walk further forward, so I can just rest there. And then follow him back. But I need to go a step down. Right. We'll get it this time. Walk down along. Stand here. Go down and then So he can't see us? Bro, how the fuck do you go anywhere then? Does he ever turn? Maybe he turns? Oh, he turns eventually. Oh, he comes up. Nah. No. I didn't... F oh, man. I hate it. Now it is, I might just go... I might just go and stick me dick in the fucking blender because it's a lot more pleasurable than this shit, like. I don't like this and don't even pretend it's good. Terrible, terrible design. Who sees me when I'm here? Nobody can see me in this spot. And that god up there does, never turns around, does he? So how... Wait there. See, he, if I move there, he sees me. It's impossible. It's fucking impossible. Lads. It's impossible. Why why are these guards Do I even have poke I've still got my Pokemon, so why am I not just fighting these guys? I can't get in there because he's looking. I cannot do anything with anything. Ah See I can walk a bit back, I didn't know that. Bullshit. One of them is fuck off. Oh my god, I hate it. That must be our stuff. Yep. It's a storage site. Hey, shouldn't Atlas be able to tell if the Tyrant Egg is nearby? It's a tremendously powerful object after all. Hmm. I'll be honest with you. I never sense anything special about that egg. Are you kidding me? It's a Tyrant Egg. It must be broken, dude. Whatever, guys. Let's check this place out anyway. This guy's running circles around the place. Yeah, baby. This must be it. I got it! This is perfect. With Nadine's power imbued into the egg, we can use it to jump over the walls and escape this place. Let's go outside and find a good spot to use its power. Let's. But I want to go north first. Oh, fuck. Oh, you can't go north at the dead end. Goodbye, my lover. 
Now oh, let's save it here. No, 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 no. Oh, jump over the wall. Happy days. Excellent. There is a guard. Oh, there's not a guard there. Take that for free. Now what we can do is put auto save back on. Do we ever become friendly with this city again? I've, have I made myself clear? But sir, Amelia's orders. My authority is as good as Amelia's. If she can put Scott here, I can get him out. It's that simple. Didn't they betray your guild? Why would you release them? This is Lateria. Since when do you care about guild business? Last time I checked, you were just outlaws, not the guild's lapdogs. We pay you to keep your prisoners. And now we're paying you to let them out. Don't think too hard. You guys need to make up your mind. On my authority as Grandmaster, I hereby pardon every single one of them. They are nothing but innocent and naive tamers. Hey, look over there. They just escaped. How is that innocent and naive? I also pardon them for escaping. Now why is this guy doing this? I, uh, okay I guess. Come with me, Scott. I'd like to have a word with you. This episode's been so full of dialogue, my throat's hurting. Tell you what we're gonna do. I'm gonna call it an episode here. All sorted. Okay, lads. Next episode, we'll go down and find out what he wants. See you in the next we've got to be coming towards the end of the game we've got two more elements to get for our egg to hatch but i'm glad that the game is not over because I, I hope there's more areas to fully explore because i'm having a lot of fun apart from that last segment which was dog shit see you in the next one lads